Hello everyone, welcome to another video. Today I am doing a subscriber or viewer inspired video. Um, we were talking down in the comment section, one of my um, viewers, and um, she mentioned that a certain fragrance um, is one of those fragrances that make her blush. That is a great idea for a video, I told her, because right now I have five fragrances um, that literally make me blush. And why, what do you mean by fragrances making you blush? Like in our conversation, she said, like this fragrance makes her blush because of the saucy comments that she received. Um, I, I'm assuming it's a she, I'm not so sure, but um, her user, her, his, it, they, them, username is, uh, I, it took me a minute to try to, you know, like think like, how am I going to pronounce this uh, username without butchering it? So it's calibrating. So it's like, okay, it's calibrating. I was like, okay, it's calibrating. Calibrating, thank you so much for this video idea because of um, your comment down in one of my videos. Um, now I'll be sharing five fragrances that make me blush. And not only because of the saucy comments or compliments that I receive, because I don't really receive any compliments when I wear these fragrances. I haven't really worn these fragrances out in the open, in the public. But um, not that I would even want to get compliments from these fragrances in this way that I would expect to get compliments from. But anyway, these are fragrances that when I smell them, they make me blush. You know what I mean. So I'm going to start with the more recent ones that I've been sampling. Um, I do have five fragrances to share with you, and there's only one full bottle. I will explain why. So the first one that I have is Cedar Woodpecker. So I did purchase a bunch of discovery sets from Parle Moi, and um, I did purchase two full bottles, and I have three other um, it's a dangerous um, set, the discovery sets that they have, because every single one that I, I test, I fall in love with them with their own different, you know, in their own different ways that they are just special. But now I have three fragrances next in my to purchase list or in my wish list from the house. But anyway, this is Cedar Peckerwood. What the fuck? Cedar Woodpecker. Cedar Peckerwood. Cedar Woodpecker. So when I spray this, I was like, oh my God, this is a this is a sexy man fragrance. So I get some sort of um, citrus in the opening when I spray this, when I smell this. I get some citrus in the opening. I get that cedar wood in there. And there is that floral in here that I don't know. But when I looked up the notes, you guys, this one only has iris and cedar wood. I know there's something in there more than just those two because I get a very strong citrus in the entrance. So this is just a very sexy bearded man kind of a scent i don't know like maybe because of the cedar like cedar name i just imagine a lumberjack but um this one is like a bearded man you know like well manicured beard or a scruffy beard i don't really care this is that you know like your bearded man with like um uh, a button-up shirt and then with uh, with sleeves rolled up like this like up like up here and then like hairy arms okay so I am, <laughs> I'm married, and if I were single, I am, I'm into men, okay, so, like, you just have that out there, because I do know that um, when you watch my videos, like, in all of my, like, romance or fantasies and all of that, or, like, like, references for what is being sexy, I always refer to, like, men, because, yes, yeah, I'm into men, so, yeah, anyway, whatever, so, yeah, this scent, it's just a very sexy bearded man. So like straight out of the shower, put some beard oil and put some perfume on himself. And it's just like, yeah, like you add a man bun too. Like you have your flannel shirt, like rolled up here, hairy arms, beard, just add a man bun in there too. So yeah, this is that scent. Then when I tested this, when I sprayed this, my nose is so itchy. When I smelled this, when I tested this, I was like, oh. I just needed a moment. Amanda Seyfried, um, her character in Mean Girls, you know, where she's like, you know what, there's like 50% 50 per, 50 chance that, you know, it's raining and you know where my hands are. So yeah, this is like that scent that, you know, like, you know what, there's like 50% chance that I'm already blushing, but, but you know, like I'm already blushing because this is what this scent does. And I'm like, and I was only just innocently, you know, just simply sampling this one. And I was like, ooh, yes. 
very sexy bearded lumberjack man. So this is a cedar woodpecker. And the name too. <laughs> woodpecker you know i know photography guy and don you know you know what i mean by that you know you guys you guys so anyway the next one that i have is from unui nomad so i only have a sample right now but i did order a travel size or a 25 mil of this fragrance so this one is memory motel so like with the image, uh, I, will, I will insert a, uh, an image of the um, sample card or the tester card because I don't have it with me. It's in my room. That image is what I imagine with this scent. So um, when I spray this, this has a very strong um, iris note. So it has iris and this one has um, um, tobacco and leather. When I first, oh my God, if, there, if, it's, if it isn't motorcycles, it's people drilling. Okay, so this one has, this is a spicy tobacco vanilla fragrance, it's floral. So this one has you know, a lot of other notes in here. It has carnation, it has bergamot. I know this is iris, incense, and leather, but when you first spray this, you get that iris, you get bergamot entrance. And then as this one dries down, you get that leather, that incense, and that tobacco, and almost like a chocolatey um, scent to it as well. So when i smell this with that imagery from that sample card i just imagine you know like driving i just feel as if i'm lana del rey you know like driving across wh wherever i am in the world and yeah just living a carefree life and her song um off to the races <laughs> off to the races um yeah the lyrics to that song i'm gonna put some lyrics in there i know i can't put the whole song or the song but this one when i smell i'm just like oh my god this is go on go on so when i smell this it's just like as if i'm her you know like i don't know like not only really that i'm her but i am you know living i am in that video or that story that she has through her songs you know it's like yeah so this is memory motel i got a travel of this one and um yeah this one this is one of those fragrances that make me like blush so the next one that i have i don't have i didn't order like a full bottle or or a um a travel or whatever but i'm thinking of getting a full bottle of this one um, I just recently sampled this one and that's why I was like, I'm going to add this because I originally had these four fragrances and I just added this one <sighs> because this is Low Explosion by Imaginary Authors. So I did get a discovery set and I didn't really test a lot of the fragrances. So this was one of the few, like one of the two fragrances that I tested first. <sighs> this one. It's another leather fragrance so this one has leather as well it's just another spicy fragrance like memory motel but this one is rose like i need another rose fragrance in my collection yeah you can never have too many or too much rose in your perfume collection as i say this one has rose it has leather it has saffron so if you got i don't know like if this one this video will go up first or the other video but this one has saffron and this one the saffron here are, are similar and they do the same thing to me and they feel the same way to me so this one is leather saffron rose this one also has the cozy beautiful cashmere and benzoin and the freshness and sweetness of green apple so what i get most here is the cashmere and that benzoin combination in the base that leather saffron and rose uh, 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 this one i th this one is really just that you know like slow explosions and you get a lot of explosions with this one because this is just a beautiful scent fragrance i don't know maybe it's because of that spice in there maybe it's because of that apple is it the leather that's doing that is it the resinous beautiful base that it has that's doing that but yeah there's like 75 percent chance that i'm already blushing so
They can't be making fragrances like this. I can't be spraying this on myself and feel, you know, but this is, yeah, this has that, I don't know, like maybe it's the name Slow Explosions, but it's really, because when I imagine Slow Explosions, I seriously thought, you know, like fire and burning log because, you know, it's Slow Explosions, but I know that there will be some sensual quality to it. Like if I imagine Slow Explosions, Slow Explosions, yeah, Slow Explosions. But yeah, this is more sensual than it is like burning logs. So it's not really like literally explosions, but it's slow explosions. Am I making sense? You guys, I never do. But yes, this one is another, I guess it just can't stop smelling myself. You know, I can't stop smelling where I sprayed it. I can't stop smelling my arm, my hand, my finger. Like, I don't know, like maybe I should get it. I don't know, I think I'm, think I'm gonna get this one. So this is Slow Explosion by Imaginary Authors. Let me know down in the comment section, you guys, if you have tried this and what your favorite is from the house because I am so scared with the um, discovery sets that I've been purchasing lately or that I purchased lately because I've been loving every single one. And um, I'm just slowly dipping my toes into Imaginary Authors and it's already making me blush. So yeah at least you know it's it's a good thing so the next one that i have is a cherry fragrance this is a clone fragrance it's a hybrid fragrance but this is a beautiful one this is a hybrid of lost cherry and um, bakker rouge 540. this is cherry casino by two of fragrances and yes look at that dent you guys i have been giving it a lot of love um yeah, I did not i did stop wearing this for a while because yeah i saw the dent there and it only have 30 mil but this is giving me fall and winter fantasies. Um, oh my gosh. This is just so, I don't know, like maybe it's the addition of that Baccar Rouge DNA plus the beautiful syrupy cherry that's giving me like, like, I don't know. Like, I don't know if it's, I don't care if it's like a woman, man, it, they, them. Are those the right pronouns? I don't know if it's a he, she, they, them, it, um, but they sexy. Every time I wear this, I know I wear this when I have like very, I know that I need to feel calm and I know I need to feel like calm yet confident. Like I've been noticing that I wore this a lot when I was training for um, my uh, in the cardiac team and I've been wearing this a lot just to you know, you know calm me down and then give me that you know like boost of confidence you know that I need and um, aside from it being like a, a, an anxiety reducing confidence boosting fragrance this is also a fragrance that makes me blush because so sexy I just love that you know how I feel about the Bakker Rouge extrait um, DNA and then you add some cherry in there as well some spice and then some cherries in there as well like pop my cherry yeah I don't know what I'm doing but yeah cherry casino by Dua fragrances and the last one I think I featured this in my I don't know uh, sexy fragrances video or like, I don't know. Like, I think I featured this somewhere. This one is, I don't have, oh my God. This is like, this fragrance and this house, like, I only have five samples from the house. But every sample is like literally making me like sweat and blush and sweat, number two. Um it just does that to me and this in particular is like ugh. it doesn't have the name here anymore but this is fatima's steam bath by trnmp or tioni reinthal rain ugh, i don't know how to pronounce her name tioni reinthal natural perfumery from australia this one this has jasmine neroli vanilla myrrh and a lot of sexiness in there. I think this has an aphrodisiac in here. I think this has, I think she accidentally added like drops of sensual fluid in here because this, I don't know. I think it's a jasmine that's doing that. You know, the jasmine combined with that myrrh. 
and I think this is tobacco as well I'm not so sure but I do know this has myrrh and then you have jasmine I don't know what what I'm doing but I've been whispering in a lot of my videos lately but um yeah I think it's the jasmine that's doing it for me it's the jasmine that's making them perk up you know what I mean um this is just oh, oh my god and it's leaking <laughs> I cannot but this it's just a beautiful fragrance. It has some chocolatey, like I don't know if this was this has patchouli, but I think the myrrh in here is almost giving me like almost tonka resin, almost chocolatey patchouli kind of feel to it as well. Oh my god, it's the jasmine that does it. I think it's the jasmine and that um, resins in here. But yep, yep, this is the number one fragrance. So anyway, those were the five fragrances that, you know, like, thank you, Calibrating, for giving me the idea. I don't know where this video was heading or where this is going or if I'm going to put it up, but I know I'm going to put it up because, you know, that's just how it is. You know, this, this is how my brain works. And today I just filmed five videos and this is where my juices are telling me to go. So yeah, a lot of fantasies and a lot of blushing going on. So anyway, um, that is it for today's video. Thank you so much, Calibrating, for giving me this idea of um, making this a list of fragrances because we do have those fragrances. <laughs> Don't tell me that I'm alone. We, you guys, you have those fragrances, a single or like a handful of fragrances that every time you smell them, you're like, yeah, there's like some 50% chance and you know, you know what I mean? You, you Don't lie, don't lie. You have those fragrances. So um, let me know if you have those fragrances down in the comment section. So, you know, like, like let's do some sniffage going on. Like if there's like a designer fragrance that makes you feel that very special way, then you know, like, we want to experience that as well. Let us know down in the comment section. And if you like today's content, please don't forget to click the like button. And um, if you didn't like today's content, if you found it like super random and super weird, um, I'm sorry, I apologize. But um, yeah, it is what it is. Um, if you are not yet subscribed to the channel, I do hope you still consider subscribing. Um, click the notification bell when you do because I do put up a bunch of videos every week. Um, especially when I'm in the mood, I put up a bunch of videos. So yeah, thank you for sharing a bit of your time watching today's content. It really means a lot to me. Have fun, much love, stay safe, and see you in the next.